Hello everyone, this is Bluebell. How are you? I'm here to read a wonderful story about a little turtle who got himself into a little bit of trouble. He lived by the sea like me and the story is called Sing to Me. So, once a baby turtle was asleep under a bush, his mother and father left him there in the shade while they explored the beach. It was a hot morning. Soon the sun was right overhead. Mother Turtle crawled back to the sea. Father Turtle crawled back to the sea too. Each thought that Baby Turtle was with the other. But he was asleep in the shade of the bush. When he woke, oh dear, he was hot. He began to cry. He cried for his mother and father and they didn't hear him because they were deep in the sea. Wild Dog did, and he came bounding up to the baby turtle and nosed him about. Like, Vook, Vook, what are you doing? Are you out there? Did you hear what the wild dog did? That's a lovely song you're singing. Will you sing it over again from the beginning? I'm not singing, I'm crying, sniffed the little turtle. That's never crying, said Wild Dog. You were singing and such a song to delight my old ears. I want to hear more of it. Come on now, sing up. You're mistaken, sir, said the little turtle. Turtles don't sing. I truly can't sing one note. You are only saying that to annoy me. Wild Dog barked. If you don't sing, then I'll eat you up. The baby turtle was so shocked he stopped crying altogether. He said in a voice that was stout and brave, All right, eat me up. Do what you like. Bake me in the sun, stew me in a pot, grill me in a fire. Sizzle me in a pan, do all of those things, but please, please, whatever you do, don't throw me in the sea. <laughs> Why not? said Wild Dog. Oh, are you afraid of the water? snarled Wild Dog, winking his eye. Look at him. Hmm, can you see? All right, I won't throw you in if you sing me a song, just a little song. But I can't sing, said the turtle. So I won't sing. Then into the sea you will go, snapped the wild dog, head first into the deep cold sea. Please, please, don't throw me into the sea, screamed the little turtle. Too late, too late, howled the wild dog. He swaggered to the water's edge with the turtle in his mouth and he swung the baby turtle up into the air and smacked down into the water far from the beach down he went and then he came and his head and he bobbed up and he was like, oh, it feels good to be back home again. Oh, this is great. I'm far away from that mean yucky, yuck dog. This is good. So then the little turtle ducked under the deep cool water, leaving the wild dog on the beach, stamping his feet and howling because he had missed out on lunch. And guess who was in the water? That's right, it was his mum and dad. So there you go, the baby turtle went from being a crying turtle to something trying to be mean to him, like make him um, trouble come to him and cause him to go into a, to his grave. He was going to be lunch, wasn't he? And the moral of the story is he ended up really happy and the person tried to be mean to him, but through the meanness, it ended up that he ended up joining his mum and dad and the wild dog was stamping his feet and howling because he had missed out on the turtle for lunch. So there you go, went out into the sea. Thank you, everyone. Thanks, kind listeners. This is Bluebell. 
and you remember listen to your mum and dad and stay close to them and don't lose them see you all tomorrow good night everyone